Hey guys, it's me, and today I have a drugstore haul for you guys. Um, recently, one of my friends got her license, so I've been at the drugstore a lot because when we're bored, we're just like, hey, you want to go to Shoppers Drug Mart? So we just like pick up and go because there's one like really close to us. So that's just like what we do, like that's where we hang out. We just go and like swatch all the makeup and just look at things and then we ended up buying stuff. So this is what I got. Um, this is collective from two trips from the last two weeks. <laughs> it's probably not a good idea to hang out at Shoppers Drug Mart, but I'm just gonna get started and I'll start with the makeup stuff that I got. So the first thing that I got is a new powder. This is the Maybelline Dream Matte Powder. And I'm in the color medium beige, beige medium. So uh, I got this powder because I had run out of my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish Natural. So I wanted to try something that was a little bit cheaper than the MAC one. So I got this at Shoppers Drug Mart for $12 and I've really been liking it. I'm wearing it right now and I find it really comparable. Um, and I just really like it. It's really smooth and it gives me like a really matte finish on my skin. And I really like this, so um, I just use this with my MAC 150 brush or my Sigma F30 brush, whichever one is clean. So just a big um, fluffy powder brush. That's what I use to apply it. So then the next thing um, and the purpose for our first trip was to get the Maybelline um, lip butters that were like the big hype all of a sudden. So I got one in Strawberry Shortcake and I absolutely love these love these so much they're so soft I'm wearing this on my lips today so soft and um, great pigmentation and I wear it like a lip balm so I really 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 love this and it's just the pink one there were so many that I wanted to get but they were like 10 10 50 so I only got one just to try it out and um, I might go back and get another one but um, I have a lot of like lip glosses lip balms and um, lip products right now, so I am just got this one for now, but I really love those. The next thing that I got um, was actually on my second trip, and it was another hyped thing that we wanted to go test out at the store. So these are the Maybelline Dream Bouncy Blushes, and I got two of them, but I'm really confused why they called them bouncy, because they're not really bouncy, like they don't bounce back. You press them and they go in, and so it's like fluffy, or like... They're kind of like that souffle makeup, but I don't know. I don't want to press mine down because then it'll get ruined and it won't look cute anymore. So, But this pink one that I got is in um, 05 Fresh Pink, and I really love this one because I have Well Dressed Blush by MAC, and I love that blush so much. Like, it's my everyday blush, so I feel like this one is exactly like that, but just in, like, bouncy form. So I'm wearing this one today, and I really love it. And then the other one that I got is... Um, in 70 Hot Tamale, which is really different from anything that I own right now. And um, it's just like really hot, um, hot reddish orange color. So I'm really happy that I got these and I love that they're bouncy. So those definitely sucked me into getting them. And then the next thing that I got is a Revlon Top Speed Nail Polish in Emerald. And it's a green color, and I did get this for a specific purpose because I am going to be doing a nail tutorial with this color. Um, I do own a few ne uh, Revlon nail polishes, but I don't typically buy them from drugstores. So I'm really glad that I got this because it's a really great quality. It dries really fast, and it really opened me up to drugstore nail polishes, so I will probably go back and get a few more colors from them. But I just needed this color specifically for something that I'm planning on doing. Um, and I need to hurry up and get on that because I always have all these ideas for nail tutorials and then as soon as I'm about to do them, I find in my subscription box that another nail guru has already done that, so then I can't do it, but, um, so I'm going to do this one because I think you guys will really like it. The next thing that I got, um, is by Biore and they're the Deep Cleansing Pore Strips. So they're for your nose, and um, it's kind of like a paper mache kind of texture, and you just put it on your nose, and it's supposed to get rid of, like when you rip it off, it's supposed to rip off like um, blackheads and like pore, anything that's in your pores, that it's supposed to unclog them. So this is eight strips, um, and I've used two of them so far because I got these in my first trip, so I have, I've had these for a while now, and um, I really like them. They're cool. I don't really, well, 
they haven't done a whole lot, nothing that I could really see like dramatic differences, but they're just fun to use and they do help a little bit. Um, if I use all eight, probably like I will see more of a difference, so I'll just keep using them. But they're really fun and I feel really pampered when I use them. I feel like I'm getting like a facial or something, so, or I'm at a spa. So then the next thing that I got are actually these um, Life brand um, Ultra Soft Baby Wipes and they're unscented so these are really great for removing makeup because when we were just like hanging out at <laughs> Shopper's Drug Mart of course we'd swatch um, a bunch of things on our hand so they had these um, available to you to use to like wipe off your hand I guess because everyone makes swatches of all the tester products so I really liked this brand and the way they worked and they this whole package was like three or four dollars so I was really excited to get these and like I'm using these to like clean everything now <laughs> And they do take off your makeup really well. So um, I'm glad I got these. They were kind of like an impulse purchase because I don't really need them, but I thought they were cool. And then the last thing that I got is kind of random, but I actually got a birthday card for my boyfriend because his birthday is next week. And I thought this was a really cool card. Um, last year I got him a singing card for his birthday, so I wanted to get another one. And he's um, looking into going into the military, so I thought this was really appropriate. Um, it's like camouflage and then it says your birthday mission and it has a fork and a bunch of little soldiers here and then you open it up and it sings and then it says eat as much cake as humanly possible hope your birthday is a success and then I can just like write in it and stuff so I thought this was really cool it was pretty expensive it was like seven dollars but I thought it was like the meaning behind it was pretty cool because it's like army and um, I thought it was pretty cool, and it's like a tradition that I get him a singing card for his birthday, so I'll have to write that out. But that's all that I got from my two trips to the drugstore, so I hope you guys all enjoyed. Um, please leave me any requests below for either nail tutorials or anything that you want to see from me. Let me know um, if you've tried out any of the bouncy blushes or the Revlon lip butters, because... These are really hyped products right now, so I want to see what you guys think of them and um, if you've tried any out, any colors that you like, because maybe I will go back and get those too. So I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!